Hey people, okay, I'm coming to you live and raw. Okay, I've been asked by um, several people how they use the Sculpt and Brow Pencil. So I'm gonna show you this. So there's no edits, there's no fancy lighting or anything, just me and my bare face. I'm gonna show you how to use this. So this is the unique Sculpt and Style Brow Pencil. It has two ends. You can see there's a lid here and there's a lid there, okay? Um, if you take off one end, you will notice you get a little suede brush mine's a little bit dirty i do apologize didn't have time to clean it but there's the brush okay it's like a little suede brush i'm hoping you can see that okay all right and let's pop the lid back on turn it to the other end and this is where you'll find the pencil you just wind it up and this pencil bear in mind this is my own so it has been used but as you can see it's slanted the pencil is slanted okay all right so it winds up and down. The other tool that I'm going to be using to do my brows using the Sculpt and Style Brow Pencil is my Brow Artistry Brush. As you can see, it's a double-ended brush. You've got the spoolie one end, which is flexible. You can bend it if you need to. And then the other end, you've got the angled brush. And the other thing I use for my brows, this is me personally, it's not compulsory, but I use a concealer. I'll show you what I do with that at the end. We're going to get started. So to start with, I take my brush, my brow artistry brush and I use the spoolie end and I literally brush through my eyebrows so brush them up just to make sure they're all lying laying in the right direction and I just quickly brush them through and I take the pencil all right I'm using the shade brown you can get this in five different shades now what you want to do is angle it and you're following the line of your eyebrow of your natural shape of your eyebrow okay so i angle it i'm holding the pen at pen <laughs> the pencil as you can see towards the end middle to end of the actual pencil i'm not right up close here all right because you don't want to add a lot of pressure this is really pigmented you get very light strokes Once you draw on the outline of your brow, as you can see, you can see the difference, my natural brow to the one that I've just used with the Sculpt and Style Pencil. And then you can begin to fill it in. Once you're happy with the way your brow's been filled in, okay, you can then wind down your pencil so you don't snap it off, okay? Put the lid back on, turn it to the other end and go to the brush. There, once you've brushed through, take another look at your brow now don't worry if you look at it and you're like oh no it's too big or too small it's wonky that's where the concealer comes in so i'm just going to show you another way of doing your brows on so this if somebody side. isn't confident with tracing the outline of your natural brow another way of marking where you're how how to do your brows is just literally marking it out so you can take the brow pencil and you can mark it out mark where your brow starts mark where the where your arch is now the arch of your eye will be the center of your your actual eye okay so if you put your pencil up here there's your center that is where the arch of your brow will be okay so you can put a little mark here and then the tail of your brow and then you can literally do dot to dot i hope that makes sense okay so you've outlined your brow Okay, using the dot to dot method. Okay, now it may look a bit weird. I Bear in mind, brows are not meant to be sisters, they're meant to be twins. So one brow will always give you problems. Okay, it will. That's it, brows done. Okay, now you'll notice here on this eyebrow, the arch goes higher up here in the inside compared to this one, okay? This is where I get my concealer and I tidy Using my brow. Using my up. brow artistry brush, I'm going to use the brush end with the angle brush here and my concealer. <clears throat> and all I'm doing is I'm winding the bottle up. I'm taking a tiny little bit. I'm not even going inside the bottle. I'm just taking a little bit off the, the wand there. And then I'm literally, you go underneath your brow. And again, you trace it, you draw a line. So this is where I can tidy it up and correct the shape of how I want it to look. And with the excess concealer, I 
drag that down from my eye bone towards my eyelid and blend it out. You don't want to have a harsh line. Now you see the shape of that brow has now been altered and it's cleaner in terms of its shape. It's cleaner, it's sharper. Okay, let's go and do the other side. So there you go. Um, real and raw. I've got no other makeup on. I've just literally done my eyebrows. I've got no concealer, no foundation, no nothing. Just my skincare. All right. But that is my eyebrows using the Sculpt and Style brow pencil um, in shade brown, my uh, artistry brow brush and my concealer. That is it. Those are my three go-tos for doing my brows. That's my brow kit. Okay. But like I said, you can just do your brows with just this. But if you're extra like me, then you want this. tip. If you want your brows to look good all day and all night or all day and all night, set them. Use a setting product. Um, we have at Unique 2, we have a prime and set powder and we have a prime and set mist. Um, either are good. I use both. So this is our um, Prime and Set Mist. So it comes in this this pot bottle here. It's it's literally a mist. You just spray. There you go. My brows are set. Okay. Foundation. Anything else you've got on, it's set with this. And you can prime your and face we have with our Prime and Set powder, which is this. Okay. Um, so like any other setting powder, oops, just flown out the, the bottle there. Get your brush. Dip it into the powder and just lightly dust over your brows. Okay, you can leave it to set for a little bit if you want, or you can dust it straight off. I usually just let it let it dust straight off. Okay, and that's it. And again, you can use this for your foundation or anything. Basic else. kit. Let me just go over it again. My basic brow kit. Okay, basic, 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 complete beginner. Just get yourself the sculpt and brow pencil. All right, and a spoolie. Okay, it doesn't have to be double ended, but just a spoolie. Okay, the spoolie end. All right, basic, basic. If you're going up a level and you're a bit of a perfectionist, a bit extra like myself, then you want to have a concealer. All right, okay. And if you're wanting your brows to stay on fleek all day, all night, then add yourself a setting product, whether that be the setting mist or the powder, it doesn't matter. It's your choice, okay? Those are my recommendations. This is what I use for my brows. Every time I do my brows, this is what I look. use. It. Okay, now it seems like it takes a long time, but obviously I'm taking longer because I'm showing you. But once you get used to doing it and you find your flow, it will take you no time at all. And using the concealer is optional. You don't have to use the concealer. You can just literally use the brow pencil, but I'm just a little bit extra and I'm a bit of a perfectionist. So I have to, <laughs> I have to use my concealer to tidy it up, but it is optional. So I hope that helps. If you've got any questions, just give me a shout and um, I'll do my best to help you. Anyway, speak to you soon.